first day of the rest of your life. Okay, maybe that's a little much, but let me show you the YouTube Easy Resume extension. It's an incredible way if you watch a lot of YouTube videos to make sure that you're finding the right video, that you're not spending a lot of time looking around for things. Personally, I use it all the time. I find it to be incredibly useful, and I wanna show you how this extension can make your life better. Um, if you're trying to revisit a video you didn't finish, or sometimes you're watching a show, all the thumbnails look the same, you're trying to find the right episode, don't worry about that anymore. We got this great interface. It's going to help you find the content that you want to finish watching. So this is a setup guide. I'm going to be starting from scratch, showing you how to get up and running. It's very simple. There's just one or two things I want to make sure everybody knows. Go ahead and install YouTube Easy Resume on Chrome or Brave, if that's your cup of tea. Cool. Installs fast want everyone to understand we're not storing your data anywhere on any server everything's just being saved locally so i promise there's no way that we could ever access what you're watching that is your business 100 percent. once you've installed it you may need to close chrome and restart it for it to work correctly so i'm gonna go ahead and do that quit chrome cool restarted chrome check out your extensions by clicking the little puzzle piece up here you'll see you have youtube easy resume as a new extension but the icon isn't available in that corner until you click this little pin button so i'm going to pin the youtube easy resume extension now i got this awesome little icon up here and if i click on that i can see the interface for the youtube easy resume extension gonna pull up youtube this also works if you're watching a youtube video embedded on any site works totally fine whether you're on youtube.com in particular or somewhere else I'm gonna pull up a video. This extension was made by Annenberg Media. We're a student-run media organization that has a bunch of different outlets, including a radio show. Gonna jump in a little bit here. Now that I'm registered as having watched a little bit of this uh, video, if I click on the extension, I should see that this YouTube video is now showing up as something that I've started watching but haven't finished yet. There are some settings that you can tweak in here. Uh, if you see this little gear icon in the upper right corner, I'm gonna click on that. I can tweak what I want to show up on this list. Here you get to determine how long you want videos to show up um, on this list for. It defaults to 30 days. You can make it way longer and keep an archive of everything that you want. Um, and if you want to check out our content on Annenberg Media, there's a link to our YouTube channel right here. Definitely encourage you to check that out. Let's pull up another video. I'll pull up one of our full episodes of our newscast. This is part of why we came up with this extension. Our news shows are 30 minutes long. Not a lot of people are, are necessarily chilling out and watching 30 minute long videos on YouTube all the time. So this is a way that you can start watching a show and maybe not watch the whole thing in one sitting but be able to return to it. You'll see there is this little easy resume icon at the bottom of your YouTube player here. If you want to disable this, if you ever don't want it to be including videos you're watching, you can go ahead and turn that off and then it will disable easy resume until you turn it back on. Here I'm going to pull up another video from our YouTube channel. Let's say you want to um, take something off. You can just go ahead and uh, hit this trash can icon, select the videos that you want to remove from your list of easy to resume videos and delete it just like that. There's a bunch of functionality built into this thing. You can customize it um, to make it useful for you. I find it useful for me. Uh, with that, you should be set up and cooking and well on your way to a better world of being able to access the YouTube videos that you want without having to search around or watch the wrong thing or try to figure out where you left off.